Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another um, algorithm um, challenge on Code Wars. Um, this is a very simple one, which is about um, converting an array of strings to an array of numbers. So, if you're given an array like this, which are just having strings, how do you convert it to an array of numbers? So, they are basically two. Um, Two fundamental things to know in JavaScript to solve this first is converting um an array is converting a string to a number and then knowing how to look through an array so that we can do it um in in in, in a loop form. So if I have an array like this, if I have a a variable like this in order to convert it let me just do a if you, in order to convert it to a number we just say plus a you add a plus in front and it's going to convert it and we're going to do a loop using a map that is if we have the string array like this um if i have a string so the variable is the string array given as a parameter here i can loop using a map so every um element inside is a string and i'm going to return plus of that string so map permits us to loop through and then uh, this is the looping variable created and then for every element inside as this is looping we do a plus and we return which means it's gonna map it changes the original array that's it that's very simple and uh, let's see if there were other approaches you can use a for loop like in other languages still works Oh, we can use this another one pass pass float pass float um changes um a number uh, a string to a number if the number was a float we also have pass int ah, here to convert to a number so um this is my variable a let's put the uh, Four inside. Sorry, forty-five. So I can say number of a. You see, this was a string. It converts to a number. I can also say um pass int of a. It works, but this use pass float because the exercise said um those numbers could have been float too now this is something like we did the same thing so you can see it is very simple so um see you on for another uh, challenge this one was a simple one we'll do something more robust so that we can learn many things thanks and don't forget to subscribe